Vince, you're gonna draw a cinnamon roll. Yeah, we hope you're gonna follow along. We always hope you follow along because we love drawing with... Friends. Yeah, friends. Like our, you. Yeah, our art friends. Now you need something to draw with. We're gonna use markers. You also need... Paper and something to color with. Yeah, you ready to start? Yeah. We're first gonna draw the swirly part of our cinnamon roll, and we're gonna draw one over here on the left, and then we're gonna draw another one over here on the right. So we're gonna start here, and we're gonna start in the middle of our cinnamon roll. Watch me, we're gonna draw a big swirl like this. We're gonna come over, and look at this too. I'm also drawing it so that it's squished. You see how it, it looks like an oval and it's kind of squished like this. Yeah, it's swirl around. Oh, think about all that frosting. Mm -hmm. I love cinnamon rolls, especially when Mrs. Hubbs makes them. Hers is the best. They are she the best. She puts extra cinnamon on them. Yeah, and even just recently, she added sprinkles to the top. And yeah, my head exploded. And now they're all gone. <laughs> and now we need more. We ate them all. Yeah, <laughs> that day. <laughs> Now we're gonna draw the frosting that's dripping down. We're gonna draw two curves that come out on each side. I'm so hungry now. I know, me too. <laughs> then we're gonna draw a wiggly line for all of the frosting drips that come down. Oh, and, and yours don't have to look like mine. They can look different. You can draw lots of drips. Good job. Now we're gonna draw the side of our, our cinnamon roll coming down further. I'm gonna draw this one coming down further too. Oh, I'm gonna make him even a little taller so that we have room for our funny face. Our funny face? Yeah. Huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there you go, keep going. Nice. Good job. Now we're gonna connect the bottom. We're gonna draw a curve that comes around like this and then connects over here to the other side. Now we're gonna draw our second cinnamon roll and I'm gonna draw it a little slightly higher so that it looks like it's further away from this first one. And we're also gonna use overlapping, so we're gonna draw part of it behind. We'll start here, we're gonna repeat the same steps. Draw that swirly goodness on the top. Deliciousness. Yeah. And then connect it in. I like that your cinnamon rolls are a little different than mine. They're both turning out awesome. And I think even with yours, because it's a little smaller, you might not have to draw any overlapping. Or I could draw a super ginormous cinnamon oh, roll. Oh yeah, you could even make it bigger if you want. <laughs> now let's add the frosting. I'm gonna draw two curves, one on each side coming out further. You can't just have one cinnamon roll. You, you have to- You need a thousand. Y yeah, you need a lot. <laughs> We're gonna draw that. The frosty wiggly line coming around, wiggle, and then connect it in. Oh, that Ooh. looks delicious. <laughs> now, see on this side, my side line is gonna come behind, so I'm gonna leave that off and just draw this side over here. And I'm gonna draw a little shorter so that it's higher on the paper, yeah. I like that yours isn't overlapping. That's cool that it's different. I like yours that it is overlapping. Oh, thank you. Okay, then we're gonna repeat that same step. The last step is to connect or curve the bottom like this and then connect it into the other cinnamon roll. Next, we're gonna draw our funny faces and you don't have to draw the exact same funny face. In fact, you can leave them off if you just wanna draw cinnamon rolls. Yeah. Now you're gonna draw different ones than me, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so first one I'm gonna draw over here is I'm gonna draw the circles. So this one's gonna be really happy. And then this one over here is going to be- Mad, I'm just kidding. Oh, could be mad if we wanted. I'm gonna draw the eyes closed like what? this. What? Oh, wait. <laughs> I didn't even <laughs> I didn't even notice you. <laughs> we did the same thing. Then we're gonna I'm gonna draw the letter or the number three. I'm gonna do this. Oh, I like that. <laughs> I like, I like your tongue down. sticking out. I drew my three backwards so that it looks like the lips want to kiss the cinnamon roll over oh, here. That's cute. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna I'm gonna add those little. Uh, smaller circles over here for the highlights, and then color in the big circle. What are you gonna add to your other cinnamon I'm gonna roll? add normal eyes. Normal eyes, or just open eyes? Yeah. 
Okay. That makes Normal. sense. Yeah, no. <laughs> now I'm going to draw this one really happy. I'm going to draw a line across and then a U shape like this. And then a tongue in the middle. And then I'm going to color in the top part. Oh, I like those cute eyes. Those got to have eyelashes too, don't you think? Yep. Now we still need to do one more thing to our drawing. Color it. Yeah, this part we're going to fast forward, but at the end you can pause the video to match the same coloring. We did it! We finished coloring and drawing our cinnamon rolls, and your two cinnamon rolls turned out so cute. Thank you. I love them. We used biannual markers to color our drawings, but you can use whatever you have at home. Now, if you have the same markers, we use three different browns or light browns. We used a Y900, and that was for the frosting. Mm -hmm. Then we used Y611, and that was for the, the main part of the cinnamon roll, the bread down at the bottom. And then for the cinnamon, we used Y529. Those were the three brown markers. We also added other details to our cinnamon rolls, but you could change your drawings any way you want. We hope you had a lot of fun drawing your cinnamon rolls. Yeah, we do. We hope you had a lot of fun, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.